Hi guys, it's Dave Farmer, and welcome back to my series on Reaper. And I just wanted to point something out really quick. I am using Reaper 5, but I'm using a theme that makes it look like Reaper 4. It's just because I'm used to using Reaper 4, and I kind of like the layout of it a little bit better than 5, at least right now. But let me show you where you can set that. Up under Options, you go down to Themes, and you can choose Default 4. When you first open up Reaper 5, it will be the default that looks like this. But you can see the tracks, they look fairly similar, but some of these things are in different places that we're going to talk about in other videos, like this Effects button, where you can power off and power on the Effects Rack, or call up the Effects Rack for this track. This is the default uh, version 5 theme, but I'm using version 4, which puts it here, over on the right. So you decide which one you like to look at, but for the purposes of my videos, if you're trying to follow along, at least the first 12 or so, um, I've already made those videos. I'm using the default um, version 4. You can, you can download other themes from other people that look like different things, like there's one that looks like Pro Tools. I actually think this looks fantastic, but I don't use it because it looks so much like Pro Tools, I get sort of confused sometimes with what's in the front and what's in the back. So I like to have it look different than Pro Tools when I'm using them both together. Here's another one that looks pretty cool. It's the Albert one. That looks pretty awesome. And another one here is really great is Fusion RJV1. That looks pretty slick. Anyway, I'm using Reaper Default 4.0 for my theme. So if you wind up downloading other themes that you want to use, here's where you put them. Go to Options, go down to Show Reaper Resource Path in Explorer slash Finder, and that will open up the folder where you find all sorts of um, Reaper support files, and they go in this folder called Color Themes. You just drop them in there, quit and relaunch Reaper. At least I think you have to quit and relaunch it. And then your themes will show up here under the Themes menu. So I'm just showing you this to help avoid any confusion down the road. So thanks for watching. See you next time.